Good morning, everyone. Week six of our Wellness Wednesday series of showing you Mackie Shillstone's amazing workouts that he's done over the last what, 100, 150 years Almost or so? Almost 45, 46, no, I, I'm Who's 71. Somebody out there do the math. 16 oh. years of age when I started, 71. Who's counting? We're not oh, counting 50, at all. My, <laughs> 54, thank you. <laughs> See, well, that's what happens when you get older. I can oh, exercise, well, but look, I'm beginning to be senile. You're in better shape than all of us combined, including the professional athletes that you've worked with. So whatever you're doing, something is going right. This is now week six of these amazing workouts that Mackie's been showing us week three of some upper body muscular endurance workouts that he's been showing us. The first week was parallel in the center. The last week our uh, last week was uh, low to high and then now we're doing high to low. So he's going to do the exact same workouts but showing you how that different range of motion is affected when we change the positioning of our uh, elasto band. These are really cheap 10 20 bucks at your local sporting goods store. Mine are so, a little thicker. Um, what April talked about we went parallel we went to the incline. Now we're going to be on a decline. All right. It changes the angle of attack on the muscular system. It challenges it. Yeah. Remember, you have now, at the end of this segment, will have seen the entire 16 exercises. I do 20. That's 400 repetitions when you add the couple that I'm doing on both sides. The idea is that you just do what you can do. If you do just 10, if you put them all together, take a minute to break in between, you know, you, you can get this done in, easily in 15, 16 minutes. We all have that amount of time to Breathe do normally, something. you know, and, yep. and so look, I'm going to be here. Perfect, let's start. I'm going to come under. Okay. I want to be close to my body. I'm going to lean. Now, notice I'm leaning down in a lunge position, okay? Thumbs. All right. Notice I haven't changed my thumbs in any of these exercises yes. week to week. Instead of putting those palms down, having the palms facing inward, thumbs are up. But notice how Mackie isn't coming all the way out. So we're not necessarily worrying about getting a full range of motion. We really want to work on uh, contracting and releasing those muscles in an effective and in a safe way. You can uh, sit down in a chair if you have a higher door that you're putting these in, or you can sit down on the ground, whatever works for you. Put your back against another wall if needed. Notice how, again, he's keeping those elbows in, thumbs are up versus down, protecting those shoulders. You just got up so easily on that. <laughs> Overhead extension, reaching those arms all the way out. You don't necessarily want to lock your elbows out, but we do want to reach and keep your hands close so you can control them a little bit better than letting them fly out towards the sides. And again, he can get a little bit closer or further away if you want to make this a little bit more challenging. Notice also how Mackie's knee is not going over his toe. He's protecting his low and mid and upper body. And then what do we have next? All right, we have our, what do you call these? Tricep the ski, extensions. Tricep extensions. Acting like you're skiing, extending those arms back, and then pulling. Notice how Mackie's not going super far back, so protecting those shoulders, elbows, everything. Coming back down onto the ground, elbows in, pulling out. Again, you can extend those arms all the way out or keep them a little bit bent, whatever works for you, but notice that he's not arching that back and pulling all the way back. So again, you normally do 20 of these. Um, you can just start with five or start with 10, whatever works whatever. for you, and or you, you can do 20 if you, you, you're uh, a little bit more up for it. You don't have to use a cord this thick. Yeah. And notice you kept on seeing me adjust to accommodate, to be successful. So I put all three weeks together, that would be 400 repetitions when you consider that one exercise did this and this, yeah. and one did this and this. So it, adds up to 400. It does, and that sounds so overwhelming, but you, you do this, what, you said 12 minutes? I, I do this in 12 minutes, yeah. but I don't sacrifice form. I don't take a break. Am I suggesting you do that? Heck no. I'm telling you what I've been doing and what we have to do with people like Serena, because remember, we don't have a lot of time, so we have to be so focused. Everything's got to be perfect. Yeah. Or Linda Hamilton, for the movie, we had so much to do, we couldn't waste the time. Sure, well, I think this is great. A lot of us are really busy these days, especially with so much going on in the world. So all of us have at least 10 to 15 minutes to spare, even if we don't necessarily do all of these dynamic movements in one session. So thank you guys so much for joining us for another installment of Wellness Wednesday. Visit Maxwell Nutrition and check out all of this amazing information in their products. And of course, visit www.tv.com and click on the health tab. Thank you for showing us your secrets. Although I feel like this isn't all of them. Mm. We'll see. Teach them what you know, but not everything you know. <laughs>